I'm going to show you how to look for gas leaks. And pretty much, the best thing you can do is go to the, uh, your home center and pick up some gas leak detector. Either a spray bottle or a dauber. And the main thing is to know what it looks like. So we'll put some on there. No. It's a lot of the scent. They don't even pick up the smallest things. But you gotta be patient with it. I'm kind of creating the link myself. I don't have an actual link right now. So we'll go ahead and let that sit. But over time, you can leave it and come back and it'll show you the link. So, we're going to go ahead and let that sit, and then we'll come back and take a look at it. Alright, we have a leaf forming. Now, I just want to show you what the kind of expect here. See the big bubbles? That means you have a leak. If you have little bubbles on top that just sit there, that's not a link. But the large bubble, or you have like bubbles that look like um, grapes, that's a link. Uh, large bubbles are a link. Um, so that's what I want you to look for when you're looking for gas leaks. If you smell the gas in your house, you know. Um, Unions are really good places to look for links. Obviously, if there's a small gas, you know what to call the gas company. Um, but the hunt the links on. That's what you're looking for as far as the link goes. Okay, now another way to do this is if you have. A load this soap. And mix up a little bit of this soap. Just clean this off, our link here. Another way is to use some just some nest up in water and throw it on there. And don't really have a mixture, I just mix some up. Use a brush to put it on. It will not bubble up like the, the uh, gas leak detector. But I guess uh Watch and it's harder to tell if you have a link here. I probably should have mixed it a little heavier, but We'll let that sit and see if it makes a mumble for us. Alright, you can see the big mumble on the side. That's just from dishwashing liquid with the water. A lot of times, that's not as good. You kind of might have to keep an eye on it. So when you soap it up, you might have to keep on doing it. You just can't walk away and, and uh, expect to see a link every time. 
now. But the gasoline detector, you put that all the walk away, come back, if you have a link, it'll be a number up and the mum will stay. So there you have it. A way to look for gas leaks. There's a small lot up there. And you find yourself a leak. So there's pretty much a uh, just a real simple method to look for gas leaks. Um, I hate to say uh, anything but if you see the link uh, go ahead and tighten it up. You also have a link on top there, it looks like. Let's bubble it up. So, if any, anywhere, if you smell anything anywhere, soak up every single joint, thread, metal, anything you can find. Uh, put the uh, stuff in a spray bottle, especially on like almonds and that flexible lines. Hit that flexible lines up everywhere you can do it. Go ahead and uh, soap it up. Try and find that leak. Of course, if you can't, uh, you might have to call a plumber to help you out or. A lot of times the gas company will come and they'll help you or they'll shut your gas off and they'll call a plumber. So, but if you're looking for gas links, here's a, uh, a simple way to, to harm that.